number you have dialed has been changed. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's vlog, uh, pag-usapan po natin about for homeschooling, okay? So, paano ba, paano ba tayo mag-start for homeschooling for your child? So, how do we, how do you start for homeschooling child? So, um, bago natin, uh, ano yun, etalakayin natin, um, ano, ano ba yung homeschooling? Uh, Ano bang uh, pagkakaiba, different from homeschooling to uh, public school? So, before we go further with homeschooling tips get uh, started, let's first talk about homeschooling versus public school. So, homeschooler, oh, no, sorry. <laughs> so, homeschool learning is very different from public school, but there are some public school who offer programs um, from home. So, yan yung difference sa kanila guys. So, from schooling versus uh, versus uh, public school, diba? So, so from starting homeschool, so you started homeschool, uh, you want to know to start homeschooling today and look for homeschooling tips for getting started. So, ito ay uh, uh, 10 tips to guide to get started homeschooling. So, una, kailangan natin mag-review homeschool laws for your state, like your country, saan po tayong uh, bansa, so where we are in the state or your country or uh, like Philippines or anywhere you are in the um, America or in the Middle East, kung saan po kayong bansa or in Europe. So, kailangan din natin i-review for homeschool laws. So, um, kung ano ba siya, um, or it is legal or illegal to homeschool in some other countries outside of the US. So, meron siyang si homeschooling laws is very vary by state and it and it is illegal to homeschool in some other countries outside of the US. So, pangalawa, so kailangan din natin ni intindihin as of being parents that's qualification for your area. So, kung complicate ah, uh, ano, kung qualified uh, quali kwalifikado din ba kayo sa uh, pagiging homeschooling so ang pagkait ni ko nito pag homeschool ano tayo so, um, um, sa ating anak is uh, parents are not required kung ano kang uh, anong natapos mo to have a college degree to homeschool but most states have a minim uh, minimum education requirements like GED okay guys so hindi naman uh, required na meron kayong college degree as long na meron kayong guide so meron kayong homeschool kung anong curriculum na ginagamit nyo guys sa uh, merong FB page sa uh, ano uh, Philippines school uh, Philippine homeschooling yan, yan yata yun meron isa-search natin yan guys i-ano ko nyo sa inyo dito at ipakita ko sa inyo yan so yan e, dito po isa-search nyo so ay uh, okay, kung anong curriculum ang ginagamit nyo to ginagamit nyo guys ano nagulo ako guys so yun uh, yun ang ano natin so pangatlo <clears throat> so hindi kailangan i-record yung ano ha kung anong college degree nyo as long na kaya nyo uh, mag homeschooling sa anak nyo like especially now na uh, sobrang hirap natin na ipaaral natin sa labas kasi walang walang school dahil na sa pandemic na ngayon nangyari so so I just sharing you guys kung paano tayo mag start na for homeschooling so ito yung um, um, unang hakbang na gagawin natin guys so at least may idea kayo binigay ko kayo ng idea so, kasi ang ginagawa ko kasi nag-homeschooling kami dito sa bahay. Hindi talaga kami, ano, mayroon din kami mga ginagawa sa bahay. So, so ayan guys. So, so pang, uh, pangatlo. So, kailangan mong i-figure out your child's learning style. So, paano ba natin i-figure out the learning style? So, everyone learns different differently and observing your child's learning style right from the start. Will you save time, money, and frustration? So, kailangan din natin uh, i-figure out your child's learning style. So, alam din natin, uh, alam din natin kung anong i-alam natin sa ating mga anak kung unang uh, gagawin. Kasi ang homeschooling kasi nakasave siya ng money and uh, nakasave ka siya ng money. At na, na, banding din yun sa uh, kayong mag-ina. So, 
na maganda rin yun sa ating pamusul life nakikita nyo naman si ano si Cheska Cheska Garcia is a dog creamer di ba homeschooling din yung ginawa nila so nakaka-inspire lang din sila guys uh, they are uh, well known na artista di ba very famous sila guys so homeschooling lang ginagawa nila guys so parang nakaka-inspire din dag why not di ba gagawin din natin kasi wala namang kasi nasabi na college degree kailangan ng college degree na para mag-homeschool sa ano basta kailangan lang natin na um, ano, uh, meron tayong guide, meron tayong uh, curriculum na ginagamit, bibili kayo ng mga libro kung anong uh, kailangan at saka meron kayong mga charts na gagawin for, eh, for every month from the last vi- for my last video uh, yung tips and, tips and tricks for homeschooling so uh, anahin nyo rin to guys anahin nyo rin to, panoorin nyo rin yung uh, para meron din kayong ideas so so number four so discord your child and yourself so you have to discord this your child and between your child and yourself so for number five find a homeschool support community so kailangan din natin ng meron tayong nagsusuport sa ating sa ating komunidad like uh, meron naman sigurong fb group na for homeschooling so kailangan din natin maging collaborate sa kanila siguro so when you're starting out in homeschooling it's easy to get overwhelmed so having homeschool community online or in in person meetups is extremely helpful. So so yun guys, di ba? So find a homeschool support community. So uh, pag initing na you need help, so uh, let's help each other. Um, comment lang kayo doon sa baba. Uh, let's help each other kung ano natin uh, anong maitulong ko rin sa inyo at uh, yung uh, ibibigay ko rin sa inyo yung mga free homes uh, educational resources which is free lang to guys so na uh, sa mga sa mga teachers na nakukuha ko lang din sa website nila so ayan guys so number f- uh, number 6 choose homeschool learning method so kailangan meron din tayong uh, kailangan din tayong mamimili that, uh, guys kung anong learning method ang ginagamit niyo guys so there are many homeschooling methods like uh, like Montessori, so unschooling, like classical homeschooling, and uh, eclectic homeschooling, and many more. So, meron guys. So, depende sa inyo guys, anong method na ginagamit nyo, yung British, ano ba, yung, um, yung early childhood ba, anong gamit nyo, ano, marami kasi guys, marami uh, sa fairy dusting, meron din guys. So, na, depende sa inyo kung anong, saan, saan area kayo, saan kayong state na, ano, gusto nyo yung gamitin na so uh, ayun guys so number 7 so select curriculum or courses there are so many options of homeschool it's curriculum online courses that will assist you in home education so kailangan din um, kung ano sa inyo meron din curriculum or courses na uh, kung gusto nyo yung mga online courses kung anong pipiliin nyo na home education so mag, ano din kayo uh, marami siyang option guys so uh Pero ako kasi hindi na ako nag, ano, nag-online courses. So, ang ginagawa ko lang, nag, nag-research lang ako, guys. So, uh, so binigil lang ako ng idea. Para, tapos, I have silently read or uh, silent Twitter. Kasi meron kaming group na homeschooling, like homeschooling preschool, homeschooling for kindergarten. So, meron siyang ano doon. So, pag, uh, kung anything na you need uh, help, uh, meron silang ano, uh, gag-guide kanila. Uh, kasi, kasi nagtutulungan ngayon yung, yung group na yun na sinasalihan ko. Kung gusto nyo rin sumali, sabihin nyo lang sa akin, mag- uh, kind lang din kayo doon at uh, at i-add ko kayo doon sa group na yun. So, so number eight. Kasi ang uh, choosing, choosing uh, homeschooling kasi, choosing learning method and homeschool curriculum is something people think that they have to do as a so, when starting homeschool, but it's actually one of the last things you should do. So, those are actually homeschooling myths. So, yun mga myths lang yun to you guys. Sa. Don't worry, we'll discuss all about and more in more detail. So, skip, skip uh, watching guys, okay? And don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channels, okay? So, okay. So, merong mga tanong, uh, ano ko dito. So, ang ano, uh, 
why do you want to homeschool? So, paano ba? Bakit kayo mag-homeschool? Uh, ano bang, uh, bakit napag-isipan nyo? Or, gust, uh, ano nyo pa lang, plano nyo pa lang mag-homeschool? So, why do you want to homeschool? To homeschool? So, people asked, so I like to ask people to reflect on their reasons so that they are they're, they're clear on why they're choosing homeschooling. So talking for responsibility for your child's education is a serious business and I want you to do it to the right reason. But don't be scared, right? So don't be scared for anything. So, so chances are homeschooling is something you've been thinking about for at least a little while right now. So maybe you want to homeschool because of poor experience at public school. Tama? So, I think ganun din ang ganun kung ano, parang i-homeschool na lang natin kasi hindi kayo satisfied dun sa public school na yon So, so ang ginagawa nyo lang is uh, nag-homeschool na lang. So, uh, I think merong ganyan na ano, di ba, uh, iba-ibang feedback natin. So, or, or maybe you become more frightened with the uh, current climate in our society. So, baby, ganun, di ba? Or maybe you realize that you can uh, you can better meet your child's needs than traditional educational system. Tama? I think so. So, maybe or yes or no. So, depende sa you guys. So. so, whatever you reason, there are many other friends homeschooling for the same ones. And a variety of other reasons you may not have even thought about. And if you're like if you're and if you're like me, when I started, you may be wondering if you're going to alone in this journey. So if you're going to have hard time finding solution for your kids, or how do you test your homeschool kids or tell what they're learning? So and maybe you've been wondering what kind of people homeschool. So Sana, huwag kayong mag-alala guys, huwag kayong matakot, huwag kayong uh, nahiya or ano, don't be hesitate or don't be, uh, ano, uh, daw nito yung, um, uh, nag-alala kayong anong unahin nyo, ano bang unang, uh, unang gagawin yung hakbang. So, kailangan natin uh, magtulungan guys. So, kung gusto nyo rin matuto sa from school, kung gusto nyo rin na mas sa tingin nyo is, ano, kapag kayo akong, uh, na tao nito ay yung sa tingin niyo ay kaya niyo gawin uh, i-homeschool niyo kung gusto niyo kasi uh, mas kung mas power kayo sa dad mas alam niyo paano ang gagawin so mas mas sa tingin niyo as marami karapat dapat ka marami siyang malalaman tungkol sa uh, uh, bawa uh, sa iyo sa iyo bilang bisan ina so bilang isang ama kung ano man kayo or foster mother niyo na anong ano niyo sa inyong turo nyo sa inyong anak. So, ganyan lang guys. So, kasi sa honestly, I and many other homeschool fans that think that homeschool, homeschool statistic is on the low end and that they are actually seeing find more homeschoolers than the data reflects. So, you see that every homeschool state has requirements that homeschool families must alert the state that they are homeschooling. So, every state has different homeschooling laws and requirements. So, yan guys. So, Pag-observe tayo guys kung anong uh, kung ano yung pinaka the best sa inyong uh, ano, gawin yun yun. Uh, at mas, I hope na marami kayong natutunan sa akin guys. So that's the last, uh, that's the end of my uh, my vlog. So I hope you enjoy my uh, my video. So don't forget to uh, like, subscribe, and hit the bell button. And uh, uh, comment down below, okay? So, comment down below para po kayo updated sa aking video. So, this video, uh, my channels uh, uploaded uh, every Thursday. Thursday po. So, once a week po ako mag-upload, guys. So, always watch out for my next video, okay? And watch my last video for tips and tricks, okay, guys? I hope, uh, and educational, uh, educational, uh, and also educational free resources, which is really good and very helpful to all of you okay and um thank you for watching guys and see you next time bye bye